Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel 9 React tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about user state hook. User state hook is used to track a state in functional component. So let's see how can we use user state hook in Laravel 9 React. So first of all, let's create a new functional component. So go inside the resources directory, then JS pages and here uh, let's create a new file here and file name let's say file name is a color component okay dot jsx and now uh, here first of all let's import the react from react and also import here use state okay small use a state And now here yeah, let's create the functional component. So right here export default function and function name color component and inside this function uh, let's add here this state and uh, in a slice with the default value. Okay, so right here const and the state name color. All right. Uh, here color is the state and uh, another which is the set state uh, here set state is a function which is used used for update the state okay and uh, then equal to use state and inside this uh, use state uh, let's pass here the default value uh, for the color okay so let's say default color is red okay and now return and inside this just add the empty tag and then inside the h1 tag uh, let's add here a text any text like my favorite color is this one color Now save this file and uh, let's create a route for this color component. So let's copy this component name and uh, go to the routes folder then web.php and here let's create another route. So right here route column column get and add here the URI color then add here call, callback function and inside this just return inertia column column render and just pass here the component name which is color component okay I'll also add here the semicolon now save this and let's check so switch to the browser and go to the url localhost 8000 slash color okay now hit enter and you can see here the text my favorite color is red okay now uh, let's see how can we update the state so for that uh, inside this return let's add here a button so right here button type is equal to button and uh, add here a text change color okay and inside this button uh, let's add here the on click event on click is equal to inside the curly bracket add here the arrow function and then uh, just call this function okay set state so right here set a state uh, sorry uh, just to add here the name set color okay this is the state and this is the function set color now just call uh, set color and inside this pass here the value so uh, let's pass here the color blue okay now save this 
and let's check so switch to the browser and you can see here the button uh, this time you can see uh, my favorite color is red okay now change the color so click on this button and you can see here my favorite color is blue okay if i change the color uh, let's say green save and uh, okay default color red and let's click on this button and you can see here color gray so in this way you can use user state hook in laravel 9 react so that's all about user state hook in laravel 9 react so thanks for watching this video and if you still have any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching